All right, boys. <laughs> who the hell are you? You all know exactly who I am. I feel like it's been forever since I did one of those intros, so there you go. Big shout out to all of you guys that tuned into our live stream. We streamed two times, one in the nighttime, one in the morning, and we did two, you know, 900 gem summons on the one, and it was like a blast. For anyone that watched the second stream for Jazzy, he literally went two multis off stream, and he walked away with the one, another copy, and he walked away with Lost Fane. You'll know what I mean. He walked away with a really bad pull. Uh, if you've seen the last stream, holy crap. Uh, just so you guys know, he walked away with something really good afterwards. I felt like it was necessary to say, because, yo, he got some bad luck on that stream. In today's video, we got a few things to talk about and have a little bit of fun with this one. If you are new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button, take that notification bell, and leave a like. It helps out massively on the channel, and it takes me a while to edit these type of videos. I appreciate you. Let's try to crack uh, 200 likes on this video. Let's keep it simple. Big shout out to all of you guys. Let's go for it. So for you guys, a quick thing that I'm going to say. I did this in my live stream, but a lot of people weren't able to get to it because it was a little bit more in the middle of the live stream. Uh, but again, we do have a secret box code for all of you guys. It is, you got to go over here, right, top right, claim it. Uh, then you can type in the code. I don't have a keyboard plugged in, but it's 7DS one year. There you go. That's the code 7DS one year. I quickly typed it in for you guys. Boom. 7DS one year. Hit open. Boom. It'll show you the animation and you'll get this quick reward. It's part one and a cute, amazing hawk emoji. One of my favorite ones. Holy crap. Okay, now let's jump into the actual topic for the video. All right, so hopping over here on Twitter, you guys are taking a look at what we got here today. Uh, we have a few JP leaks to go over and a really massive global leak. I'm going to move it fast just to get to the global leak because mostly we're going to talk about global here today. But we do have Denzel coming over here to JP. Really, really cool. Uh, this is what it looks like. You guys can see in the video, he looks pretty cool. This is exactly his model. These are the new costumes you guys will be able to get. Not bad. It looks really, really sick. Over here, we got two more costumes. We got this one and we got this one. Again, they don't look that bad. They look really cool in my opinion. I love this one a lot and this one looks cool. It's from the show. Uh, but again, let me know if you guys like this unit. Uh, personally, I don't know about it. It's a unit that will jump on the part three banner or part two banner. I have no idea where this unit is going to go. Technically speaking, isn't Denzel in part two, so he might jump on the part two banner. Uh, but he is here. It's pretty cool. For anyone that is curious, this is what the banner image looks like. So on this banner, it'll be a 6% banner. If you don't know what that is, it's like for SSRs, you have a 6% chance instead of the regular three to four. Uh, it's a really, really solid banner. It's going to have Denzel. It's going to have uh, Sariel and Zarieri. And I believe something is a drawback with this. I think you can only go 10 times on it. Uh, there's a limit of what you can do with this banner. Uh, everything is level 80. You are uh, six star awakened. All of that cool, cool stuff. And apparently people are talking about how there's a festival banner going to be following this or again we still don't know what happened to a collab i really think the collabs have been just murdered uh they've been just destroyed i have no idea what netmarble plans to do with the collabs but it could be that this is a bait banner bait your uh, gems out then throw a collab in or throw a festival in possibly I'm, I'm seeing it be a festival banner following this one this is just you know a bait banner uh because the two most wanted units are on it sariel and derriere uh denzel i think is guaranteed at some number uh, I really don't know much details about this, but this is the image we have. Over here are his costumes. I showed you guys in the beginning, like when it was the videos. These are the three costumes you're getting. Uh, not bad, not bad. It looks like we're going to get a rerun over on JP for Final Boss Escanar. So we can hopefully, 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 hopefully expect this soon on Global. Uh, but again, you know, and, and this is Global at this point. We don't even know when we're going to get this stuff. Uh, just keep that in mind. This is the image, the banner image when it goes in like that uh, notice tab. So there you go. Also that. Here's the full banner image for you guys. It says 10 right here, I believe. I don't know, again, how much you can go into this, but it's it's kind of a, it's kind of a hype up into a festival banner. That's what I'm predicting this will be. Uh, this could be like you get some free uh, multis on it. And if you do, that's actually pretty insane. Uh, right now, I have no idea how it's gonna work, but if this is a uh, hype up banner into one, we could see some free multis on it, some pretty cool stuff. Not bad, not bad. This is the ticket. So this is the stuff we might get for free. Who knows? Loading image, something simple. These are the costumes, this is the image, this is the SSR coin, this is him, and now, the big boy thing. Currently, in the files for Global, we have the Holy War Festival Part 1. Now, before we take a look and dissect this thing, can we freaking talk about how, like, Melascula is the default PNG? Like, bro, they straight up did everyone as a new PNG. Everyone is a new PNG. And then it's just Melascula vibing at the top. Like, bro, I swear they forgot she was in this, and they just put her PNG in it. That is the funniest thing I've seen in a while. Uh, it's literally just her vibing up there. Like, look at that. But yeah, Holy War Festival Assault Mode Engage. Enjoy part one of the Holy War Festival with 7DS. Right now, I'm almost guaranteeing we have a, a, ma a banner in the middle, right? So we could have uh, Dan for Liz. We could have, uh, what is it? 
awakened mono maybe we could have the summer units on a banner we could have a banner before that uh or a valentine's banner that could also work reminder on the jp version of this banner they did have three new year's units right so for us we could see valentine's units we could see a lot of things um but again this is in the finals so be ready for it honestly net marvel was planning to drop this already so i would have un understood if it was in the files but it was recently added with this so the next big big banner coming to global will not be a collab probably it will be uh assault mode so as i said three to four weeks this banner will drop get your gems ready just you know last uh spend your time preparing uh again i'm going to make some pvp videos with uh, the one s run let me know if you guys are down for that i usually don't make pvp uh, videos on this channel but i kind of want to do it also for example for you guys real quick on february 11th we got the one thing obviously we already knew the one was coming out but usually when we get these type of leaks, like, we know it's coming soon. Uh, Denzel was different. Again, I guess you could say Denzel uh, took a little bit to drop because we was leaked, like, two weeks ago. Uh, but I can almost guarantee this will be coming out in a few weeks, so just be prepared. I hope, I hope Netmarble doesn't drop any big banner before that. We could probably see those, like, units that are left just be sandwiched together on a similar step of banner. Uh, again, that being Nanashi, that being the Summer units, that being Awakened Mano. Maybe we see Valenti and the other Easton. Uh, but again, I really think Summer units will drop before that. Who knows what's going to happen, but just keep that in mind. As I was scrolling, Dana for Liz, I just saw in the uh, leaks from uh, 70s Leaks, he tweeted it uh, for, again, Global. This will probably, 100% guaranteed, will be the next banner. Somehow, it'll be uh, Dana for Liz incorporated with any other unit. Uh, the Elaine banner was the biggest skip banner, so we can just have a massive skip banner where it's just uh, Dana for Liz, only Dana for Liz. But again, I think Net Marble will try to uh, not really bait your gems out, but they will try to force a few people to summon. And I think Dana for Liz is not the unit to do that. Uh, it's really gonna not do much. I think no one possibly, probably will summon on a Dana for Liz banner. I'm just saying that because that's my entire theory. We're going to get a decent, decent banner before Assault Money drops. That's really it. That's been all of the leaks. Again, we had the Stranger Things that happened last month. I don't even know what happened to that. That's dead. Lost the time. That's all the leaks. Denzel, be prepared. Uh, the Holy War Festival Part 1, be prepared. Uh, we have a lot of things coming out soon. So just, you know, we'll see exactly what happens to this. I'm just letting you guys know. New festival coming soon. Or maybe, maybe, maybe a collab. Let's see. It's going to be pretty hype. JP having a lot of new content. Global having one of the greatest events ever. I can't wait. And again, it's been a little bit since I made a video for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, notifications on. Big shout out to everyone uh, that joined into the last streams. I hope you guys enjoy them. Let me know if you want me to stream more often. Do some more summons live. Uh, because that was a really, really hype stream. Thank you again for helping us crack almost 3.3k on the channel. You guys are literally insane. Peace out, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Laters!